new tonight. How do free trips on the Midtown and Downtown Tunnel sound? With Governor Glenn Youngkin's signature on the new state budget, it's going to become a possibility. Today, 10 on your side, investigative reporter Brett Hall found out the free tolls will be available to way more tolls than even the governor seemed to realize. He joins us live now from the downtown tunnel with that story, Brett. Marilyn and Tom, yeah, actually when we spoke to the governor, he uh, just emphasized the toll relief for ports within Norfolk, but the way the bill is written, Three other cities are actually included in the eligible toll relief, but in order to have it, you also have to make under a certain amount. With the signing of Virginia's next two-year budget, Hampton Roads drivers are in for the possibility of signing less money away for tolls at the downtown and midtown tunnels. At least we need to do something to bring those tolls down. It became a priority for State Senator Louise Lucas as she landed the coveted finance chair position. Today by phone, she told me, as promised, she delivered. Governor Glenn Youngkin agrees. In negotiations, it was a priority. Uh, Senator Lucas and I were talking about this from the beginning of session. Beginning in July, if you make less than $50,000 a year and live in either Portsmouth, Norfolk, Newport News, Hampton, or Franklin, you'll be eligible for up to 14 free trips a week under the Elizabeth River. You can also see any toll debt you owed forgiven and receive an Easy Pass transponder for free. We also asked Yunkin why only those five cities. The specific target was to really focus on those folks that live in those areas that use, use the tunnels uh, predominantly, and particularly it started with an understanding that the folks in uh, Portsmouth and Norfolk are the primary users of the tunnels. Uh, and this is the this is the route that the negotiation landed. According to a report from the state, they are considered to have high fiscal stress in which median income is factored into those findings. But Lucas says she isn't done and plans to continue trying to move forward with proposals to discount the tolls and eventually eliminate them altogether. Now, how much would it cost to eliminate these tolls altogether and get the toll out of there for all of us? Well, around $2 billion right now. And try getting $2 billion in a budget for just people in Hampton Roads, Northern Virginia, other parts of the state, they're not going to do that. So Lucas says she's going to continue to try to chip away at this project. Now, we still have to find out exactly how the relief is going to work. Commissioner of Highways has to come up with that beginning July 1st. Live in Portsmouth, Brett Hall, 10 on your side. Brett, thank you. Toll relief is the topic of our poll over on wavy.com. We want to know from you, do you pay a toll on your daily commute? Right now, about 74% of you say yes. You can head to wavy.com slash connect to give your opinion.